Hey YouTube, it's Alicia here and I, uh, I just got through washing my hair and I am going to show you um, how I mold my hair. I mold my hair several different ways. So today we're going to be doing a little bit different. Um, it's been um, on the 23rd of last month. I had my hair perm, so it has been not other 11 days, and my hair needed to be um, washed, so yeah. It's easy, um, so I'm going, um, so I'm going to uh, have a perm in my hair, so like I said, it's been 11 days since I had my hair um, um, perm, so that's almost a week, so without further ado, let's get started. Um, so um I already so we already have the sides done but to make sure I have it the way I want it like right here and right here and the um you can use any wrapping foam but this is something I've been I brought um earlier about March and I've been using it and I've been using the Nairobi wrapping setting foam lotion and I love this so I am going to just do this do the sides first and I'm going to bring it up into the bang so while i am doing this i'm gonna calm the bang a little bit now uh for some of y'all who don't know yes i have a perm but if um you go back and you look at my natural hair products videos um you'll notice that i do have a natural curl pattern when a perm is not and let me just say not in my hair all right set that right <laughs> right there all right so we're going to just comb that all the way through bring it back and we're going to comb it all the way through So we're going to keep that. And we're going to just pull this right here. And I'll give you why I always put my bang over to my right. I am right-handed. And sometimes, you know, you never know what side you put your bang on. And I put my bang on my right side because this is, um, it's more, this side is the most least side of a, to, um, to getting the bang. It's just, this is just how I just do it in things so we're gonna just take the bang and we're just gonna pull it and we're gonna pull the rest pull that right to there and now after that we're gonna take the brush and this is i take a big thick brush and this is all i do now if my hairdresser does it she like it's going to swoop and she's going to do it almost like a full wrap she will fully 
wrap it, but I just don't do that. And that is it. But yeah, this is it. Let me get. Uh oh. And once you get through with that, we're going to just wipe the edge in. So you're going to take this towel like this, put it on the back. And what is excess of the wrapping foam, you're going to do that. Do this. And that's it. This is all I, that's, this is. This is one of several um, wrapping ways that I wrap my um, sit use um, wrapping foam. But yeah, this is one in the way that I let it go. I let it go by drying. Now, if you want to know what is my top um, wrapping foam, I will be happy to. But just to remind y'all, I have a perm at the moment, but I have that good black girl hair. I will leave a a little bit more detail in the prescription of my hair and thing until then i'm alicia don't forget to thumbs up this video comment below and subscribe